Hello there, I am Giant Quote and welcome to my side series, welcome back to my side series where I show uh, video games that I own, yeah. So today we are going over my 3DS, Nintendo 3DS collection. So I have 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, I have 6 3DS games. And I also have, I think I also have, um, it's, uh, The Legend of Zelda uh, Ocarina of Time 3D also uh, for Virtual Console and whatnot. But yeah, so yeah, I don't have that many 3DS games as you can see, but these ones, again, like I said, last time I did my Nintendo DS collection, uh, these these six or seven, wait, one, two, three, four, five, six, these six games right here, they've got to me through the whole Nintendo 3DS timeline. Like, I feel if you have these games, you're in good shape, I mean, you, uh, Kind of know what's what about the 3DS and what games to have. I guess I don't know. It's a it's really your opinion, but uh, let's get into uh, all these games individually. I'll show them off individually, like I have been throughout this series with all my video games that I have for my different collections of systems and handhelds. Okay, so the first game I have is Super Smash Brothers for the Nintendo 3DS. Uh, I bought this game at I think GameStop for how much did they want for this? I think four dollars. I think the 3DS games are usually $39.99. So I paid like over $40 for this game, but I think it was worth it. I don't play this game that much. I play the Super Smash Bros. for Wii U version a lot more with my friends from Super Nintendo Guys and stuff. But yeah, I do want to get back into this game. It's rated E10 for ages 10 and up, as you see right there. So yeah, uh, this game's still fun. I do like Smash Run over a Trophy Run or whatever it's called for whatever. Uh, I think it's like some Smash Run for 3DS and then uh, Smash Tour for... Um, the Wii U version of Smash Brothers, so yeah, I do like Smash Run over the uh, Smash Two or whatever it's called for the, the Wii U version. I do recommend this game though. Um, it's fun. I have all the DLC, all the characters and whatnot, so that's awesome. So let's move on to the next game. Next, I have Pokemon Omega Ruby because I originally had Pokemon Ruby. I still have it actually as a cartridge. Um, but yeah, I do like Pokemon Ruby over Pokemon Sapphire. Even though Groudon's weak to Kyogre and Sam the to be seeing my piss word both like Pokemon Sapphire and Pokemon Alpha Sapphire because Kyogre is better than Groudon. Statistically, it is, but I like Groudon because Groudon is really cool. I thought he was always really cool as a little kid. So yeah, it's rated E for everyone. Uh, it's for 3DS, of course. I have beaten this game. I don't think I've gone through all the Delta episodes though, so maybe not completely beaten it. But I'm not sure. I've been playing this game a long time. I want to boot it up again. See, I I even forget what team I used really throughout the game. So it's kind of be cool to like boot up this game again and see where I'm at and whatnot. But yeah, I really liked playing through this game. It was really fun. It was a good remake of Pokemon Ruby, and it's fun. And that's all I can say about it. Really. It's I had a good time with this game. And I also got this um game. I think uh, I think I bought it at GameStop for um four over forty dollars because it was thirty nine ninety nine probably at the time. So yeah, very worth. I think it's very worth it though. Honestly, I, I that was worth it to me. Next, I have Pokemon Moon, which is ready for everyone for the three DS, of course. I've been beating this game. I've uh, we got both Pokemon. I got both Pokemon Sun and Moon, but I haven't beaten this game yet. I want to get back into it though. I just kind of. Lost motivation to play this game really. Uh, but yeah, I want to eventually beat Pokemon Sun and Moon. I wanted to do this as a let's play as Camcorder Vision, like with my Camcorder filming with my Camcorder, which is the same Camcorder I'm doing to record this video. But, um, I think I'm gonna buy a 3DS capture card and then, cause that's better quality. Cause I'd rather have a 3DS capture card because I can have, I can move around better and I don't have to keep my DS still when filming it and whatnot. So yeah, that's, I guess, one of the reasons why. But yeah, I don't want to do a Let's Play this game soon, but I don't know how soon. Depends on if I do get a 3DS capture card. I'm not exactly 100% sure, but I think I am leaning towards, like, I definitely want to get a 3DS capture card. Because if I get a 3DS capture card, I could also play um, DS games too. Because, you know, 3DS plays DS games too. That's backwards compatibility. So this game is really fun. Um, I've already played through it. It's really fun. And I'd recommend it, honestly. It's again like $40, I think, plus tax, $39.99. I bought at, um games. I bought this one at GameStop, and I bought Pokemon Sun at Walmart actually, for about the same price. So yeah, let's go on to the next game. Hey, what do you know? Pokemon Sun was the next game. Okay, yeah. So I bought this game at um Walmart. Um, I bought Pokemon Moon on a uh, launch day. I think it was sometime in November of 2017 or 16. I think it was 2016 actually. 
So yeah, um, I haven't played much of this game. Like I've started to save files and stuff, but I haven't really got that far in it. But um, that's okay. Um, yeah, it's ready for everyone for the 3DS. It's a fun game so far I've played. But again, I want to get back into it and play some more of it. And yeah, that's pretty cool. Next we have Pokemon Y for the uh, Nintendo 3DS. It's ready for everyone. And yeah, I bought this game at GameStop for for four dollars plus tax, sorry nine ninety nine, and it was really worth it in my opinion. I do like Pokemon Y over X. I don't know why I like Yvolta better than Xerneas, I guess. So yeah, um, I beat in this game through the Leaf One stuff, so it's really fun. I've actually played through all this game, pretty much. So that's awesome. I do recommend it. I do. I prefer X and I prefer Y over X as I said before. So yeah, it's very worth it. I recommend it. And it's a good game. And the last game I have for my 3DS collection video is uh, Animal Crossing New Leaf. Now I haven't played this game in a year, honestly. It's been well over a year. I've I got I got into it like the first couple months, then I stopped playing, and I haven't really played it ever since. Really, again, I haven't played this in over like a year. But I, I'd recommend it still if you like Animal Crossing. It's a good Animal Crossing game. I just haven't got back into it. I want to play it again eventually, though. Because I feel I it deserves to be played again, honestly. But yeah, it's um, I got this at GameStop, and uh, I paid again thirty nine ninety nine for it. So yeah, and uh, it's still worth. I think it's still worth playing. So I'll give it another shot. So there is my Nintendo 3DS Vita game collection. And my next episode, I will be going over my GameCube, not my GameCube. Sorry, my um, Game Boy Advance games. And I only have like a four, I think. Plus, I have some on Virtual Console, like Fire Emblem. I have, um, Fire Emblem, and, uh, I have Castlevania, sorry, of Aro. I think I got a Mega Man game for Game, for Game Boy Advance. Um, I have Minish Cap on Virtual Console for the Wii U. And all the, all, all the games that I just listed off, um, you know, like, Castlevania, Aria, Sorrow, uh, Castlevania, Aria, Sorrow, uh, Fire Emblem, uh, Minish Cap, and then the Mega Man Game Boy Advance game. I think it's like a Mega Man X9 or something. Um, as I have all for, um, Virtual Console on my Wii U, so that's pretty cool. But, uh, physical copies, I only have like four games. The cartridges, of course. Because that's what the Game Boy Advance game was, the cartridge. They so plug into your, uh, put into your, um, Game Boy Advance, Game Boy Advance SP, or Nintendo DS White. So, or Nintendo DS, there's like four ways of playing those Game Boy Advance games. So yeah, this has been Janko again, I would like to wish you goodbye, and I'll see you guys in my next episode where I show off my Game Boy Advance collection. <laughs> <laughs>